What's up, guys? So I'm gonna do a Q and A mukbang, mukbang, whatever the heck. What he even? Mukbang. Hey guys, so today I'm gonna do a mukbang Q and A with bald headed Lily right here. Woo! Let's show who the really bald is. Right. Wait, I can't. <laughs> okay, what? I didn't know. Do that again. Do that again. Do that. All right, so today I'm gonna do a Q and A mukbang with the. Bald headed Lily. You know Demo who's the bald one okay, here. Okay, all right, enough. So today Yay. we've got some seafood boil. Oh my god, I'm some so excited. Some seafood boil. Ooh, I'm so excited. I've been craving this. And you know what you need when you get down and dirty? What? It's um, not what you think it is. It's some gloves. Here you oh go. Oh man, I was getting excited. All right. <laughs> <laughs> This is weird. I've never seen gloves in a little ass package like this. If someone did see this laying around in your room, like they definitely think that shit's a condom. Mama's hungry. Hurry the f up. All right, Daddy's gotta wrap it up. All right, that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> that's what we're calling the end of the video. Nah. So let's start with a new one. All right, where's my phone? I'm calling my mom. I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness, that looks so delicious. The first question. Wait, before you start the first question, let's take a bite of a corn together. We're gonna get messy. Probably my whole makeup's gonna come off. Ready? Cheers, we're gonna eat a corn. The fire, I'm not gonna lie. That's good. Do you guys have a lot in common? Um, what would you say? I feel like certain things we have in common, but majority is very different. We're very different people. Yeah. For one, I have hair, she doesn't. All right. For one, I have a, no, I'm just kidding. Anyways, I feel like we we have a lot in common, like how we view things, but like our personalities, like that type of shit, we don't have in common. Um, no. Like we're very different in that. Oh, yeah. oh my gosh, this shrimp looks so good. Wait, can we eat a shrimp like hella close to the camera for them? Mm. That's good. Mm. Now time to eat your shrimp. And <laughs> What's one thing you guys fight over? Well, who misses each other more? Yeah. Things, Nothing bad. Things of that nature. Yeah. I feel like we fight over stupid shit. Not just kidding. <laughs> we do, actually. We do. Yeah, we do, huh? We do. But it's never nothing toxic, though. Yeah, it's never toxic. Like, we're good, we're good. Well, then I'm not like... You're not answering anything? Or... You didn't get dirty as fuck. I didn't fully... Alright, no, whatever. Who's the clingiest? Be honest, be honest. Honestly, I thought it was clingy before I met Gio. But, like, Gio's clingier than me. What? But... Gio is clingier than me. Gio's the clingier one. But well, I like that. I really do. What do you think? Yeah, I agree. To be honest, can't even argue with that. That's good though. I like clingy. Okay, at, at least that. Who's better at communicating? You want me to answer that because you know damn well it's you. Gio's better at communicating, guys. He's actually teaching me how. I was never learned how. Hashtag was never, toxic household. I, I know y'all relate. I was never learned how. Wait, really? I said that? <laughs> I also was never learned. Wait. <laughs> I also never learned how to speak properly. If you know, you know. I was I never learned how to communicate. But Gio's teaching me. So Gio's better. What are your fears or phobias? Maybe you should answer that one first. Me? Honestly, I feel like I'm just scared of, like, in a, on a serious note, I think I'm scared of losing, like, people that I love. I feel like there's going to come a point in time where you get older and, like, a bunch of, you just start losing a bunch of people. I feel like that's one of those things. Um, my fear has always been to be alone. Oh, and old. <laughs> Don't forget. Oh, that. yeah. And to be old, guys. I'm scared you could turn old. I think I say that so much. You know. And Gio brings it up how much older I am than him. It's because you gotta accept it, you know? It's just, it's all freaked up, bro. But honestly, I'm scared of turn old. Turn old? 
Yeah. Oh my gosh. Do you always correct me for everything? Trust. If I say something wrong, I already know Gio's gonna straight up just be like, "You mean this?" It's not bad. It's not bad. You it's know, not so. bad, but I didn't know I was carrying my teacher around. My English teacher. No, I'm just kidding. I didn't know I was carrying around somebody with a third grade reading. All right. All right. All right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Most embarrassing moment. You go first. All right. I'm not gonna lie. My most embarrassing moment was when I was, you know, you know, I'm the I'm the oldest out of my cousins, out of the few cousins I got. And they got a soccer ball stuck in, stuck in a tree. And you know, I wanted to be the superhero, older cousin, climbed up that tree and I fell, broke my leg. I, it was bad. I got up and I was limping like a dog that just got hit by a car. I Ooh. wish I was there to see that. Oh, anyways. You? My most embarrassing moment, I spoke about this on TikTok before. Um, we're recording a video for my YouTube channel and um it was a hot chip challenge the loser had to jump in the pool and i ended up being the loser because i let everybody else win because you know i never lose and then um they recorded me going into the pool and it was raining so i started running and they were recording me my pants fell down in front of my nephew really damn he's seen like up to here it was so embarrassing Damn. Like I cried and I literally really? was like it's normal. It's normal and then I was like don't ever speak about this again <laughs> They had the clips on my phone too. Really? Two people were recording my Damn. little sister and him <laughs> Were they laughing at you? Yeah. Damn. That was embarrassing <laughs> Also like in my past I've thrown up in front of a crush before it Like was it me? No, I know but like uh, like Anyways next question. Who is more dumber? Answer that one for us. Me. <laughs> nah, you're just Me. being nice. You're just being nice. You're being nice. Who? Here, look. I peeled one for you. Oh, uh, sweet. I did, actually. If there's still some skin left, my best. Nah, you're good. I think I peeled it good. Yeah. Honestly, I think I'm more dumber. More dumb. Oh, it's my. Look, like, see, right there it is. Like... There it is again. But honestly, I don't mind because like Gio's teaching me like how to speak better and how to say words and complete sentences. This sh this is some shit I should have learned in elementary school, and I'm barely learning it. Learning. No, you said it right. You were learning. I'm barely learning it at 22. Look, but it's I better late than never. For you, a shrimp for you. Is that peeled? Yeah, shrimp. All right. Peeled shrimp just for you. Thank you. Of course. Do you guys have a retirement home picked out? No, but I actually have a nursing home that I picked out for Lily, you know, for later of on. Of course. What? I knew something like this was going to happen. <laughs> to be real though, if you put me in a nursing home, I'm going to be jamming out with all the other people like... We're both going to be in that nursing home together. Well, me sooner than you, but... You act like you're like 30 years older than me. But I'm like 30 years older than you. Yeah, you're right. Here. Put some lemon in there. Squeeze some lemon in there. I'll read that one. What? Ah! Are you dead ah! ass? Ah! You have one job to squeeze lemon in the bag and you squeeze lemon in your eye? Are you okay? I, I that, that would actually make me feel better. No, it wouldn't. Still would burn. You okay? Which eye, both? No, just the right eye. What caused you guys to start social media? You go first. Well, I've always loved making videos since I remember I was like eight years old. I will record videos and be like, you know, act like I was a YouTuber. And you know, I never really started until I was like 12 and I've been doing it ever since, you know. Yeah. It's just, I just got a passion for it. What about you? Actually, what caused me to start social media? <laughs> Look at me. I was born to be an entertainer, baby girl. I just always did dumb videos on my phone. 
And I always wanted to be a YouTuber, so, I mean, that's about it, I mean. <laughs> Straight to the point, I like it. It is literally really bald. Alright, that's Pull up the video, pull up the video, pull up the video. Take down the video, bang no. his ass. Hey guys, so for today's <laughs> <laughs> You know damn well. What? what is your idea of the perfect date? You go first. You know, I imagine the perfect date, something simple, you know, having some sandwiches in a, in a picnic basket, you know, like, something in a bottle like you know maybe like some lemonade Drugs. or oh yeah yeah lemonade like some lemonade or like some really delicious cold freezing water sitting down in like an empty field like in front of the water or something you know just having having like a a, a journal where we could both write our thoughts just talk about what we're doing something something calm you know something chill what about you um honestly Anything, anything, any date with you, you know, that will, that's what I think would be perfect. Mm. That's a hint to take me out on a date. I have. Anyways, I'm gonna pull up my hair. Three fingers off. Three fingers. Oh, three, that's a lot. No. <laughs> <laughs> No, it's because I want to take it off like perfectly so I can slip my hand back in. How did I, how do you? There you go. So I just slip my hand back in. This is. No, 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 it's because, uh, hold on. It's hard. It's really hard. Ew. I don't want to know what's hard here, honey. All right, that's good. Oh, well, take it off the glove so we will. My nail's stuck in it. Hey, pull it. There you go. Thanks. Just leave it there. I'm gonna tell my hair, this is getting too messy. Anyways. Wait for me. Of course I'm waiting for you, honey. <laughs> you know you liked it. Alright. I feel like a burp's gonna come up the other way. You're gonna fart? No. I got my hair in a ponytail. I don't even know if you can tell. Okay. Let's go. Alright. Next one. Want some water? Because I know yeah. it's like you're probably thirsty. Very Stop! thirsty. Stop! <laughs> How did I know something like... Oh. Tell me when to stop. <laughs> holy moly. Come here, come here. I know CPR. Oh my gosh! I know CPR! Oh my god, you're literally extremely red. Get up, get up. God damn, you went fuck time. Get up! Get up, girly pop! I need someone to give me CPR. I got you. Get up! Oh. Are you okay? <coughs> no, I am not. Literally, okay. your whole chain like moved. No, I just fixed it for me. I'll sweet. <sighs> I am very sweet. You should taste me. Anyways, let me get more water. Are you guys gonna date in the future? You should answer that one. You answer it. You. I want to know too. What do we date in the future? Um. I think that. Where do you see yourself? Wait, I want to know what he said in the last question. Anyways. Where do you see yourselves in 10 years? <clears throat> you go first. Dead. All right, that's it. I hate when Jill talks like that. Don't you dare. Be fucking for real. I'm being for real. BFFR, queen. Be fucking for real. I'm being for real. In 10 years, he's going to be married with me. We're going to have about four kids. What? Well, I mean, in that case, I guess I'll live. <laughs> in 10 years, we better be married. Have four kids. Um, Gio's gonna be still performing in his concerts. Um, I hopefully will be an actor. And yeah, I guess we'll see if our journey heads that way. Who wears the pants in the relationship? Well, in the friendship? Well, to be honest, if we were to like actually date, what do you think? Be honest. Um, you. Ah, oh, I've seen that. 
I feel like me. Yep. I would want to anyways. You'd want to, but you'd only want to. I'd want to, and I. Sh- and I but you probably it would. It would be the best stop. It would be the best for me. You think so? Yeah. The best for you. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> this is so good. Did you really just eat it with the shell? No, no, no. Did you really just eat it with the shell? It makes it a little crunchier. This is why we aren't dating. What is the most important lesson you have learned so far in life? Me first? Yeah. That... <clears throat> nobody's gonna come to save you. You gotta do it for yourself. No one's gonna do it for you. If you want something in life, you gotta get it yourself. You can't wait for the perfect moment or wait for someone to come and help you do it. It's not gonna happen. It's never gonna happen if you don't do it yourself. You? Um, one lesson I learned in my life is to stop feeling sorry for yourself and actually better your life. Like, like he said, no one's gonna help you in your life you're a hold of your own life, honey bunch. Get into it. Do what you want to do. Make it happen. Stop saying you're going to do it and just freaking do it, bro. Seriously. Stop procrastinating and get that shit done for real. I say just get up and do what you want to do with your life, to be real. That's a lesson I've learned. Because I, like, I feel like you've had the same dreams. Like, oh, I want to become a YouTuber. I want to become a TikToker. But it's like, you can keep saying that shit, but you're not doing nothing about it. Once you start doing shit about it, that's when shit starts moving for you, starts happening for you. When I took that road of actually doing it, look where I am now, you know? Anything is fucking possible in your life, bro. That's all facts! All period! All this period! No, just kidding. <laughs> you just got period blood on my elbow! Lick it off! <gasps> is soccer your favorite sport? That's gotta be racially Beaner. motivated. Is it though? I wanna know. <laughs> yeah, it is. Messi or Ronaldo? Messi. You? Messi. Right. Who is the funniest? Lily, of course. Wait, that ass? Like, are you just saying that for the vlog? No, of course not. You're obviously the funnier one out of the two. Bro? Guys. Obviously, you're the funnier one out of the three. Who the? Who else? It's like. Gio can compliment me and be like, oh, you're pretty or you're this. But when he said you're funny, <sighs> I feel like funny is such a good compliment for someone who actually tries to make people laugh. Did she just moan because I said she's funny? <laughs> I could do that again. Who's more of a jealous person, you or Lily? What do you think? I'd say both are equally jealous. Think so? Yeah, what do you think? Be honest, be honest. I think both. I think Lily's more jealous. For real? I think Lily's definitely more jealous. I'm a little bit toxic. Not just a little. No, I get jealous, guys. He can't have any other crush but me. That's fine, though. I don't want to have any other crush but you, so. I think I am more jealous. I'm a low key dog. <laughs> but it's okay. Nothing I can't handle. <laughs> that was such a big laugh. Like, <laughs> why did you choose these questions? How old is she? So, how old are you, honey? 22. Bad to be 23. And I'm a teenager. I am 19 years old. There is an age gap. But. But. But Gio is older in there. Ew! Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I keep dirtying him. Look at his arm. Would you ever fight for Lily? Or, you know, the other way around, would Lily fight for me? I would fight for Gio. Not like if Gio tried to, like. I don't know how to explain that. What? I'd fight for Gio in, like, a, a sense of, like, if somebody's trying to fight Gio, like, I'd fight for, I'd fight for him. 
Oh wow. That's but if it's like you messing with another girl and then that girl wants to fight me, no. Oh well, obviously. I would never fight. fight for a man like that. But if it's like if it's to defend you, I got your back no matter what. You know, yeah. I would drag a hoe for you. Oh wow. And I don't even know how to so drag you stuff, so. Oh no, you'd be dragging hoes. I remember I seen a video of her fighting in high school. She was, okay. She, yeah, it's kind of no. crazy. But um, honestly, yeah, I would too. You know, if someone's bullying you, you know, best believe I'm going to jail for you, so. I'll bail you out. You'll bail me out? Yeah, that's so sweet. Oh my gosh. Oh, I thought we are having a moment. Are you guys ever going to go on a trip together? We want to start a spooky series, so I feel like traveling this year would definitely be a yes. Yeah. I'm coming to the video. Questions. To finish off the questions. Okay. Go ah! Of course. So. Go ahead. When is the baby coming? I'm 34 weeks today. <laughs> You're hungry. What the? Last but not least. When are y'all gonna show us a real kiss? All right guys, well that was the video. I wanna see the kiss. Well, there's no kiss. I don't know what you're talking about. But, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I definitely did. Yeah, so did I. It was a... It was fun. It was fun. Thank you guys for watching. I love you all. And, uh... <laughs> oh, it's a little zoomed in here. It's a little zoomed in. Hold up. Oh, oh, wrong one, wrong one. Two best friends in a room. They might kiss. Alright guys, thank you guys for watching. <laughs> I love you guys. Wait, you got a phone call. <laughs> that was your feet. Ew, how did you get your feet up here? Oh. I'm flexible. <laughs> okay, alright. Alright guys, I love you all. Take care. This was and... my first Q&A. This was amazing. <laughs> I love you guys. Peace. Peace. <laughs> Here, answer the phone call for a little bit. Ow! <laughs>